school. My name is Mr. Nutty Napoli. Today is Friday, April 24th, 2020, and I am yet again coming to you live from our beehive. Happy Friday. As we do each morning, I'd love everyone to stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please make sure you re remove all of your hats. Parents, families, staff, children, the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, everyone. You may now be seated. All right. I hope everyone has a, had a great week of work with your interim learning plan with the Wellington Public Schools. Um, great day today. All right. We're going to get right over to weather. To Crazy Chris and his joke of the day. Take it away, Chris. Hi, it's Crazy Chris for weather update on Friday, April 24th. Today's weather will be mostly rainy with a high of 44 degrees and a low of 35 degrees. And now today's joke of the day is, what flies around the kindergarten room at night? The alphabet. Back to you, Mr. Nutty Napoli. Thank you, Chris. All almost, always awesome as always. Chris, Crazy Chris. So we have some rain again today and I think Saturday, it's going to look really good, like 60s, so get outside. It's going to be really nice. And then Sunday might be more rain. So maybe next time, next week, we'll have Chris do the forecast for the weekend. But we've got some more rain coming our way, folks. April showers, hopefully, will bring a lot of May flowers and warm weather. So uh, lunch today, please, or first of all, have a great breakfast this morning and make it healthy. And then, of course, have some nice lunch. Birthdays, 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 folks. We have one elementary birthday today for Willington. Olivia Boardman Loso from Mrs. Kelly's class for today, Friday. Happy birthday to you, Olivia. Uh, have a great day. Enjoy. There are no staff birthdays until we get into the middle of May. All right, some important news from the news desk here at the Beehive. All right, so I just want to go over a few things, folks, that I've already mentioned, but I want to kind of hone in on a couple things. Um, the, we will have out today a digital backpack for PTA notices, information, quite a few from, from the father-daughter dance, the daughter dance to all the information for the yearbook. The um, fundraiser is due today, folks, so make sure if you're going to order at um, Square One Art, we'll have the website and everything for you. Very simple to find your child art and to place orders for Mother's Day or for grandparents or, or, or fathers, whatever you'd like to do. Um, it'd be a great gift that you can order online and receive at your at your home. Um, what else do we have here? Okay, so I did share with you yesterday that the um, we're moving to the Seesaw app on the Clever.com page um, that we'll be starting to use. Teachers have been experimenting and exploring with it this week and putting up some sample activities. It's going to be more teacher-directed lessons using this application uh, where you'll hear their voice a recording or them doing a live video of a mini lesson and modeling for students. So a number of activities will be on there and students will submit their responses to us and they'll fall into a journal. Uh, but I will do more of a tutorial on that probably through Zoom and record that and show my screen and, and help folks see how it works. But again, students will log in through Clever through the same process, click on the Seesaw app that you have seen already. Um, and then they'll be able to work and navigate through the activities that the teacher provides for that day. All right. Um, also, parents, keep an eye out for an email from teachers, if not today, next week, early next week. Um, in terms of communication, I know I think preschool has been using Class Dojo and kindergarten through fourth grade primarily has been using Blooms. It's been a great program for us, but 
Seesaw has a very nice parent communication component where the teacher or myself can, can email you directly and that could go to an app through a Seesaw family or right to your computer through the Seesaw website. So keep an eye out for an email with a QR code that's gonna come from your teacher, it's gonna come from an email, and then you can then it's unique to your child. So then you could sign up and you'll be able to see communications um, and announcements to you and all, all kinds, it's really good. I, I practiced with it all day yesterday with a parent and um, it was very helpful. So stay tuned for that. So that is gonna be our way to go. Blooms will be out for the most part. Um, and it's gonna be strictly Clever and the Seesaw app, and the parents will communicate with us through Seesaw. Um, you can always send an email through to, a, to, a, to me or to a, a teacher, of course, um, but the primary and I think the best way right now is through the app. Okay. Um, there also, you can also share pictures and whatnot as well. Um, next week, I'm going to meet with the fourth grade today through a Zoom conference or actually a Google Meet, and they're going to take over the news desk. Um, I want them to get back. This is this is their program. This is their little project that they were doing every day at school. Um, I just kept it going and to kind of keep everyone together. And I will still be part of it. Um, but I want to have some of our students back. They're excited to rejoin. We have a director coming back and a couple of news desk folks. Chris, Crazy Chris will stay with us. So we'll see some changes next week and we'll decide how many days a week we will do it. It might be two or three. I haven't decided or maybe it'll be the five. We'll see how we do it. So just be patient with that because we've been learning a ton of technology from a distance. All right. Um, I think that's it for right now. Boys and girls, it's Friday. Please continue working hard with your learning plans. All right, get some good reading in. Um, get onto iReady, whatever your program has for your grade level this week or today. Um, Clever is a great, great application or great um, site for you to find all the apps. Don't forget Mr. Phillips, Ms. Um, Specter. Uh, Miss Redding and Miss Benitez and Miss Castle are all going to start using Clever. And eventually, within the next week or two, they're going to join us on Seesaw potentially with activities on there for you to complete and submit so they can give you feedback. And, um, you know, you can do some specific activities from their, from their classrooms, from their, uh, their areas of expertise. Okay? So work hard today. Have fun. Um, get outside tomorrow on Saturday. Today might be a little bit too rainy, but... Um, Make it a great day of working, okay? Work hard. And keep sending us some pictures and stuff because we'd love to see what you're doing. All right. Parents, teachers, staff, um, anyone in the Willington community that would like to uh, share any special announcements or information or concerns, please email me directly or you may email beehivenewslive at willingtonct.org. At Center School each morning, boys and girls, please join me in saying our character pledge. At Center School, we are respectful, responsible, and caring do your best and be your best and always be safe. Don't forget about our Look for the Good project and our wall, as you can see there, my little mini uh, wall of gratitude wall like we had at school. Do a great deed. Be kind to your family. Be helpful at home, okay? Um, you're home a lot with your family doing school. Please help out with chores and be a good citizen and make good choices and be kind and grateful, okay? All right. So we're going to wrap up our broadcast. Well... That wraps it up. Beehive News Live. I'm Mr. Nunn in Napoli. Have a fun-filled Friday. Work hard. And have a great weekend. Take a break this weekend. But don't forget to keep reading, all right? Don't forget about Epic. Great program. Have a fun Friday. Have a great weekend. Work hard today. And we'll see you at some point next week, guys. Take care.